The Buncombe County Sheriff's Office is moving. The deputies are leaving their current location on Haywood Street and moving to the new county building. It's an effort to save money and bring deputies closer to the court system. As News 13's Cheryl Barber reports in tonight's reality check, they're also leaving behind a long list of problems. Down through the years, they've had to come in and upgrade the HVAC. As you look over the edge there, you'll see a lot of the different upgrades. Uh, they're doing some kind of uh, upfitting on it right now. Sheriff Van Duncan says his office's headquarters has served well, but outlived its usefulness and 1970s building codes. It's well, it's not in with the Americans with Disabilities Act being able to have access for folks with disabilities is a is a concern for us. To install an elevator, replace the building's old electric furnaces, to rip out all the old baseboard heaters, to install new ductwork would cost too much. Plus, the building leaks. Water has ruined the plaster in some offices. Ceiling tiles are damaged. This is one one place where the whole floor of the building had to be torn up uh, to fix some of the issues with the water runoff. Renovating the old building became more and more expensive, and fixing it up didn't address a key problem. The courts are blocks away on the other side of town. I think with the location of the jail behind it and the courthouse in front of it, it seems like a perfect location to me. General Services Director Greg Israel shows us the top floor of the new Buncombe County Courts building. He's planning to spend $1.8 million to turn this wide open fourth floor into the future home of the new sheriff's office instead of renovating the old building. When we figured that dollar amount out and uh, got to looking at it, even with doing all that, we still had a design from the 70s and it really didn't fit sheriff's needs. So that's what got us to look into over here at this building. Reporting in Asheville, Cheryl Barber, News 13.